Well, good morning. Well, the day after Christmas. Whew. Finally got everything picked up. I'm gonna do some solo fishing today. Uh, all by myself in one of my one of my lake right next to my house, I guess. Um, try to catch some fish. Um, you know, it's always been weird when you actually pre fill this uh, introduction. Whenever there's introduction, introduction went out, and then if you don't catch the species, it just looks like idiots afterwards. So, I'm not gonna say what type of species I'm trying to target for, but mainly for crabbies. So hopefully walleyes will be there too. That's one of my favorite species I always try to target. But at least there's crappies. Um, they are pretty nice size, between 10 to 12 um, inch crappies. So. So I got everything packed it up. Today I will be some, doing some solo fishing. Um, yeah, the day after Christmas, just great. Hopefully everyone had excellent, wonderful times. You know, Christmas time with your families and you know, you guys celebrated it. So right now it's about 6.36 a.m. Um, the temperature wise is still at minus two here. It's cold. Um, I'm prepared. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna start driving down there to the lake right now, and hopefully, hopefully, we're gonna catch some fish today. So. All right, I'm all set up here. Since I'm going all by myself today. I make sure that I have all the safety precautions. So I'm making sure that I got ice picks, got my bibs, flowing bib on, and then I got carbon monoxide alarm. So I will show you guys why I'm actually heading down here. This lake pretty much have absolutely nobody right now. I think I made it. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I think I made it out here. Whew. Yeah, you definitely need like ATV next year. <sighs> Nobody had this lake right now. <sighs> Besides me. Jeez. <sighs> well, let's punch a couple of holes. Let's see where they at right now. So, all right, folks, I'm finally all set up. Um, like I said, I'm doing the solo today. Um, so I only have a PC funds, uh, 3i basically in the tent set up super warm right now like i said right now i'm marking a lot of fish as a matter of fact there's one fish is coming up right now so it's tracing my minnows right now so let me see where i'm sitting right now is just super shallow as you guys can see i'm at eight feet right now and there's a fish right now let's see if he's gonna buy it i'm nearly just sit sit down so let's see if he doesn't these are all the pan fish so let me Oh, these are perch. So let me show you guys where I'm working on right now. Okay. So these are all the fish. There's one. There's a crabby. However, did you guys see here if I move like this? Where I'm sits, there's a little fallen trees behind it. I want to show you guys. Right here. On my left hand corner here, these are fallen trees down there. So these are all crabbies around me right now. So so that's why I try to work on today. Whoa, 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 whoa. Pike. Pike just came. Scare all my fish. No. 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 Got him. Fish number one, guys. Fish number one. Ooh, this is a nice size, big size crappie. That's what I'm coming here for. 
big Cause they are here Early eyes I knew these are the crabbies Fish number one Can the other ones make even hear the other roars Those ones are nice size ones So what I have been using right now I've been switching up Using because the bite is so finicky I downsize it so the jig looks like little like a peach looking cutter like perch so the tail will be like this this is a heel lure they are here they just uh they've been swimming around the sizes are pretty big This just show you the bite is just very finicky. And not that hungry. I nearly tried to throw everything. Crabby minnows, that's the best bait. They don't like it. They just don't. And I lost a nice size walleye. This one's coming quick, quick. Got him. This time, got him. I got one. The better not losing this one. No, I hate this. Oh my god, dude, I'm drawing I'm drawing another hole here. Can't do this anymore. I lost nearly three things. Oh man, time for some coffee. Alright. Sit and wait. It's very frustrating. I'm lost one of a nice size walleye. Ah, oh, this is the only time I wish there is someone can actually lift up my life scope pole. Here's a fish. Just show up. This is big. Whoever that is, this is big. Big one. That's a one. I want it. I want it. Let's see if you want this one. I don't want it. This one, this one, this one, this one, this one. It's coming. Got him. Oh! So what I have been doing right now is um, I have a whole hops. Um, unfortunately, I have to do that with uh, weather is minus three degrees. All the fish is down here. So far, I caught maybe five. Every time I draw, I have to kind of move around. Um, and then what I've been using is um, it just basically is just jig and hit lures. Um, the, and the bite is just very finicky. Here's one on me right now. Alright folks, since I'm doing whole hops 
right now basically we need to make it quick every time when you drill a hole you need to make sure um, your lure is down right away so here's why I have been fond take a look at here here's the screen show you they're all here you see that so let's catch them hopefully this is school it's uh it's crabby school so it should be quick and they are here <clears throat> let's get them installation down wow jackpot this is why i don't like to stand inside a tent should be quick should be fairly quick once looking at it got him that's just how easy that is oh this should be feel like sunny oh no feel like sunny that is sunny guys but there's a whole bunch more down here so there's a lot holy holy cow so going to drop again come on go 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 hopefully let's see what's this one bam hit lure hit lure open the jig another sunny eatable size here we go they are all here so oh come on gonna go back there go back down right away there's plenty of fish down here just grab every hole like when you punch they can stay for like a couple of seconds oh man there this is a big one coming a big one traced so here we go here this one just any like he's gonna eat it come on Hopefully, this is gonna be a crabby. I think I'm sitting on top of a school of uh, just sunnies. Come on. Bam, got him. Ah, this is another sunny. Good eater. Good eater size sunny. Here's that. Try to grab. Oh wow, bass just came through. I think there's a big fish just came through. That's why I scared him away. I gotta send it back. Go down there right away. Come on, come on, come on, go down. Go. It froze right away. I'm using two pounds line. Just can't beat it. I mean, it still froze. It's like instant when I dropped. Come on. Got four more to go for my limit for Sunny. Got him. This is a good fighter. Those Sunny are all good fighters. 
These are crabby. Like I said, right now I'm sitting in the a pile of crabby and sunny. So I should be done here pretty soon. It's full of the panfish right now. Well, I will show you guys what happened. I've been just um, punching holes around my tent. And right now, this hole, it's what we called a honey hole right here. Come in. I can feel my finger. Come on. They are definitely all here. So the color is pink today. The key is in the pink. They definitely love the pink color. Bam! It's another nice size uh, crappie. This has got to be crappie. There you go. They are definitely here now. Got nothing. Each each cast is gonna catch us some fish. Swallow it. You see that? There's a good size eater, crappie, and the perch looking jig, and then also a tiny pink tail. That's the key for today at this lake. Like I said, I tried nearly I tried everything. I will when I wrap up the radio, I will show you guys how many holes I punched. This is not is the key. Like I said right now, I don't know if you guys can see it clearly. It's like nearly like every cast right now. They are here. I'm fishing at 10 feet basically. Here we go. I'm gonna get an R1 right away. Come on. Bam. Snap it. Just gotta love it when there's a panfish school. Like I said, the bite is still finicky. I mean, you want to give them a quick second before you send a hook. Oh, I had it. Plenty of fish down here at this hole. Let's see. There's a couple. Ah, I'm going to need. It's getting cold. It just doesn't help when the temperature is like minus four. I can't even feel my hand. So yeah, I think the key is the pink. They definitely like in the pink. Here we go, that's another one. That's a crappie.
coming back. Bam! This is a crappie. It's a sunny. I'm just keep guessing it around, but they just all sit on top of each other. So on that seventh, gonna put it back. The bite is just very finicky. So let me show you guys what I'm working with. So let me show you guys what I'm working with. Um, basically, the bite is just very finicky. That's my bait. These are all panfish. They just don't like to bite right now. It sits very still. So, like I kind of mentioned, I actually punched so many different holes. These are my fish. I caught. So, I got enough for dinner. Five, six, seven. So, not eight. Bad day today. All right, I think I'm just got done on my auger's battery um, for the whole hop. So basically, like what I can show you guys, I've been whole hop the entire lake today around this area. Um, that's my hops. So you can see like how many holes I have been drilled. Like just basically all over the places. Try to um, these fish and they're all circulating from this area and here are all the fish I have been caught today it's about a good 10 12 of them near the sound of them over there um, like I said pretty much I have my entire lake over myself this person just show up to just now so it was a great day um, I've really enjoyed it um, so hopefully Right now, just already ice. So hopefully, in a couple more weeks, when I come back here, I could caught. I, I I will catch my limit of crappie. So anyway, if you do like this video, please, please hit the like button. And if you have not yet subscribed for my channel, please do so. I will greatly be appreciated. So thanks again for watching my this episode. Well, I will catch you guys in the, on the water for the next episode. Thank you so much for watching.